for your spiritual sports segment on Rima Gospel Radio. I'm CJ. The Wizards have flipped the script. After starting the shortened NBA season with only two wins in 17 games, the Washington Wizards have fired head coach Flip Saunders, who was in the third year of a four-year deal worth $18 million. Assistant coach Randy Whitman will lead the team as coach for the remainder of the season. The Wizards have plenty of talent and their players need to develop more and Wizards president Ernie Grunfield stated quote, I felt like at this time our players were not responding and I think we needed a different voice. This doesn't change our overall plan which always has been very transparent for us which is to build through the draft, get salary cap space going forward and develop our young players. End quote. For your quick news and notes, as reported a few weeks ago on Rima Gospel Radio, four-time World Series champion and five-time All-Star catcher Jorge Posada officially retired after 17 seasons, all with the New York Yankees. Tony La Russa will become the second retired manager to lead an All-Star team next summer. Two-time NL Cy Young Award winner Tim Lincecum and the San Francisco Giants have reached a verbal agreement Tuesday on a two-year contract worth $40.5 million dollars and the deal also includes a $500,000 signing bonus. All-star catcher Russell Martin and the New York Yankees avoided salary arbitration when they agreed to a $7.5 million deal for one year. The Oakland Athletics and free agent right-hander Bartolo Colon have agreed to terms on a one-year contract, bolstering their depleted starting rotation. Pitcher Brendan Morrow and the Toronto Blue Jays have agreed to a $21 million three-year contract that avoided salary arbitration. The Astros added to their statistical strength in the front office, hiring Mike Fast of Baseball Prospectus to serve in the Baseball Operations Department. Chicago Bears linebacker Brian Urlacher revealed to Real Sports on HBO that he loves the game so much that he gets pain-killing injections and would not admit to feeling like he had a concussion in order to stay on the field. Former Pittsburgh Steelers offensive coordinator Bruce Arians said he decided to retire only after the team declined to give him a contract offer and that quarterback Ben Roethlisberger was unhappy with the team's decision. International Olympic Committee member Dick Pound says there is known and suspected use of human growth hormone in the NFL and claims union lawyers who seek more information about testing for the performance enhancing drug and chided the NFL Players Association's attorneys for using delayed tactics to keep HGH testing from starting this season. The Atlanta Falcons have made another change on their coaching staff, firing defensive backs assistant Alvin Reynolds. After being suspended for three games for his hit, Washington Capitals forward Alex Ovechkin has pulled out of the January 29th All-Star game. Navy has accepted an invitation to play football in the Big East starting in 2015. Penn State faculty members on Tuesday rejected a vote of no confidence in the university's trustees, a symbolic measure that has sought to chastise the board for its handling of a child sex abuse scandal. Coach Butch Jones has received a three-year contract extension and a raise for leading Cincinnati to a share of the Big East title and a victory in the AutoZone Liberty Bowl. Alex Bogomolov Jr.'s career year in 2011 ended in somewhat of a sour note when he was told to repay $75,000 to the United States Tennis Association for changing his nationality from American to Russian. And age is just a number as the Minnesota Lynx have re-signed 41-year-old center Taj McWilliams Franklin to help defend their WNBA championship. This sports segment was sponsored by Naturally Relax Massage, where you can relax, release, and relieve naturally in the greater Houston area. For rates and more information, please email naturallyrelaxed at gmail.com. To have your company sponsor a sports segment, please email me at cjsports, that's C-E-E-J-A-Y, sports at gmail.com for more information. Be sure to follow me on Twitter and YouTube at CJ Sports and make sure you download the brand new Rima Gospel Radio app on your Android phone so you can have Rima on the go. Tune in next time for more updates in your next spiritual sports segment where we sprinkle a little spirituality in your sports. <laughs> I'm CJ. Be blessed and have a positive, productive, blessed day of what's left of it. And remember to keep your head down.